I'm Hotshot Wendy, and I'm here to give you the blueprint to passing your CDL test in a week. So this means you start studying on a Monday, and you take your test on that Friday morning. So first off, oh, you can switch that up however you want. But first off, you have to be 18 years or older in order to be able to take the test. And if you're between the ages of 18 and 21, you will be restricted to drive in Georgia only. That's interstate. On or after your 21st birthday, you must go into any customer service center to have the Georgia only restriction removed. And all applicants must hold a valid regular driver's license. Once you receive your CDL learner's permit, you have to keep it for 14 days before you're even able to apply for the full CDL. Note, now the learner permit that you get after taking your written test, um, the, the, one that, the one that we're talking about now, you can only, it only lasts, it's only valid for a year. That's 365 days, so keep that in mind. Now, the test consists of three parts, the general knowledge, combinations, and air brakes. In the general knowledge, you have a total of 50 questions. You have to get 40 correct in order to pass. Combinations and air brakes, you have a total of 25 questions. Now, the answers are all multiple choice. Now, this is what you do. Go into your local DMV to pick up a free CDL manual. So, therefore, you can refer back to it. And if you do this, you will see why later in the video. Now, next, you will need to download two free apps. Both are called CDL Prep. Again, go to your app store. Type in CDL Prep. And once you do, see CDL Prep. And once you do, these are the two apps and this is how they will look. This is one and this is the other one, okay? So we're going to open the CDL Blue Prep, okay? At the top, it has an option where you can click on what do you want to take, the general knowledge combination of air brakes. Here's the drop-down bar. Those are the three you need to be focused on for now, okay? And then right here is the question. So we're going to attempt to answer the question. Okay, and we're going to get it wrong. And here, look, watch this. I want you all to see this right here. Okay, so we got the question wrong. And we're going to hit continue. It tells us why we got the question wrong. And down here at the bottom right here, it says section 2.31. That's in your manual. Go to your manual and you will be able to read just on that section there just to get a little bit more knowledge on here. But stay in practice mode. Remember to stay in practice mode until you make at least 80% three times. Okay, right here is the second CDL prep. These are levels. So at the top, you see you got your general knowledge, air brakes, and combinations. Go into each one of them. Each time you do well, you will level up. At each level, that means you're getting better and better. The only thing you're doing is trying to retain this information. See right here? It gives you an example of the question that you answered. Okay, so to get out the green screen because it's kind of... But those two apps, focus on those two apps. Go into each one of those apps. And I really like the blue one. Go into that and go through those questions on, on Monday... Focus on general knowledge only. Don't worry about combinations nor air brakes. Forget about those. Focus on general knowledge for Monday and Tuesday. Monday and Tuesday, general knowledge. Take that general knowledge section between four to five times both days. Make sure you make at least 80% on them three times. So that means you're going to keep taking, keep taking, keep taking until you start retaining the information because these are the same questions out of your CDL. They, they're pulling these questions right out of your CDL manual. Okay, so you're going to keep taking these tests until you can retain, uh, I'm sorry, until you get an 80% passing score three times. And I would suggest you take these tests at least uh, four to five times on Monday and Tuesday. You will be completely general knowledge smart by Wednesday. You won't have to worry about that. So on Wednesday, you're going to go into your air brake section. And once you start in your air brake section, that means you're going to click on air brakes. You're going to constantly take that section. Do it at least however many times, as many times as you can until 
you start making an 80 percent passing score at least three times okay on thursday you're gonna go into combinations you're gonna repeat the same process on that thursday that thursday night do general knowledge air breaks and combinations you should make a passing score of 80 percent on each one of them that friday morning go into the dmv and you take your cdl test and once you get those permits you let me know that's all it takes it's just that simple um and i know a lot of people say well i'm not good with studying you're really not studying. The only thing you want to do is retain the information.